There is news tonight about how much Americans may be overpaying on medical bills. In the spotlight because of a groundbreaking new investigation by Time magazine. And with it, here's ABC's Ron Claiborne. And this is where it happened. When Amelia Gilbert fell and went to the ER, she was diagnosed with a simple broken nose. A few weeks later, she got the bill and was floored again. Oh, I knew I would have to pay something but I didn't think it was gonna be $9,000. Including $6,500 for three CAT scans that the government says should actually cost the hospital only about $825 under Medicare rates. The charges were outrageous. The Time report by Stephen Brill found nonprofit hospitals routinely charging many patients far more for procedures and medications than they cost the hospital. Everybody's making exorbitant profits. For example, one hospital charged a patient $157 for a blood test for which Medicare pays just $11. The same patient was charged nearly $8,000 for a stress test. Medicare pays about $550. The American Hospital Association said a bill reflects not just the cost of the patient's treatment, but also, quote, what it takes to provide the care, the nurse at the bedside, and all the staff who keep the hospital running 24 hours a day. So what to do? Brill says what most people don't know, they can usually negotiate their bills down so they don't pay the price like Amelia Gilbert. Ron Claiborne, ABC News, New York.